Hello my little pine souls and welcome to another Palio Let's Play. We are finally back to Palia again. I haven't played for at least two weeks probably and I think it's time again to pick that game up. I have news. <laughs> my PC setup is now in a separate room so I have my own streaming room and I'm really really excited about that. We were busy the last two days with that. It's definitely not completely done yet because we still have to paint the walls and, and do more stuff and attach some things and get a new table and all of that. But that will take some time and a lot of money. <laughs> That's why that will take a lot of time. Um, but I'm already so happy with how it looks now and I could I really I couldn't be more happy with how it all turned out. It's so nice. I have a way bigger table now, so I don't have my mic constantly sticking in my face. And that's amazing. That's literally so cool. But yeah. <laughs> Enough of my own own uh, life update here. We are gonna play some Palia again. I do have to say I do not remember what we did last time, and maybe I should have checked out my last video, but I didn't. Well, we will figure it out. We will figure out and see what we will do today. I know we have some quests to do that we need to, uh, still need to do. I don't know if um, if if we still need to get the yellow perch. If it's like a story quest line or if it was like um, um, a weekly gift that he wanted. So I definitely have to talk to Wrath again to figure out if he still wants the yellow perch or if he wants something else. So maybe we are now free of the curse of not finding a yellow perch. But we will see. I have two beverages next to me. One is for fun, one is for fun and for awakeness. <laughs> because I do have to say, I didn't sleep that good this night. I didn't have the best experience. <laughs> um, I went to sleep around 1 and around 6 I woke up with a cramp in my calf. And after that, at 7.30 or 7.20 I woke up after a slight sleep paralysis it wasn't like anything crazy bad just try someone trying to pull me off the bat on my hand like something under the bat <laughs> and then i went back to sleep after that and i again dreamed something a little bit scary and a little bit annoying so i decided not to go to back to sleep anymore so i'm now running on let's say i'm running on around five hours of sleep Last two hours that were not really relaxing, but more exhausting. So, yeah. What's how cute are those pictures? That's pretty cute. Cute, cute. So, then I can already see my quests on the side. Reach level 5 in any skill. Learn about the past from Gina. What was that? Whatever. Uh, learn about the past from Gina, fulfill a player request, and fulfill five weekly villager item requests. And I have one of them. And how about we go and talk to my favorite boy, Rath, and see if he still wants the yellow perch. And uh, yeah, or if we are lucky and he wants something else instead. That's Ziki. Look at them all. Oh, I don't know you yet. Ziki. Just be quick about oh, it. Never mind. What is it you need? Since you're here, I may as well help you out. What do you want? Oh. Tau caught sight of a calico koi and could not take his eyes off of it. It could please uh, it would please him greatly to be able to watch it swim around all day. Okay, he wants a calico koi. Good to know. I've got Hi. the best metal you'll find. Hello, Sifu. Howdy, I'm Sifu, the Blacksmith around these parts. 
But you might recognize me as Sifu, the famous monster slayer. Okay, okay. She's a monster slayer and and a blacksmith. You look a little familiar, I just materialized from a serious point. You were dad, Sifu. Well, if you have to prank, you're not that famous. I'll just say that, because why not? The very one. How did a famous monster hunter like me went up in an acquaintance suburb hamlet to such this? Well, that's a good question. Fortunately, I have a good answer. You see, I became a mother and I realized fingering dangerous beasts, uh, beasties was, well, a little too dangerous for my young son. So I took up the position of the town blacksmith. These days, I make blades instead of wield them. Now, where was I? That's pretty nice. It's really nice that she's like prior prioritizing the safety of um, the sun. But also, where the fuck is my, my boy Ref? Where are you? Oh, he is the, the, the tailor. Okay, he's at the tailor. I don't know why, but... I guess let's let's check it out. Is this one a tailor? I think it's the tailor, right? Yeah. Hi. Let's I talk. Totally wasn't sleeping. Good job too. So I had to swing by a library to grab this cookbook I put on hold, I swear. I think Kalari might be a statue. I've never seen her leave the front desk. Where is she super super realistic looking golder? The world may never know. So what do you want? I'm making Papa's Rilana's this week and I could use some fresh potatoes. Okay, we need to get some potatoes. I don't know if we can get potatoes from anywhere. Do we have potatoes already? Okay, okay. Good to know, good to know. These things always sell like hot cakes or you you know, hot potatoes. Okay, okay. Fish, what do you want? I've got some new stuff in the shop. Ah oh, what what can I do for you? I want to know what you want. I was making flower crowns and ran out of sun drop lilies. If you spot any, could you pick them up for me? That is actually something really easy. That's something really easy, right? Snow drop lilies? Those are like the the red ones that you basically grow everywhere. If I have it right? Now how about we do that? Then I, we have that quest a little bit further as well. Let's see, let's see. Grow somewhere here. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. What is that? Oh, someone is doing something. Okay. Sundrip lilies. Hello. Why is it like the one time I need it, I just cannot find it? Maybe, maybe I have it in my inventory already. No, I don't. Okay. Let's see, let's see. Should be somewhere, right? But it's someone just like take all of them. That would be crazy. me it will be easy to find also me not finding it <sighs> why are they all of a sudden so hard to find what am i doing wrong Said one? Sandra Lily! Perfect. We can go back to the tailor now. But on the way, I will definitely take some copper with me. Just copper, right? Oh, clay. Yeah, of course, clay. Because that's always good to have. If we're already here, we can also take it with us. I really hope that my mouth movements are picked up enough because the camera is now a little bit further away and also a little bit 
higher up. Oh, maybe I should do that. Um, so I really hope it's still kind of picking it up. I know it's not really the best from the beginning, but still it would be nice if it kind of picks it up. Why well, I just have to look more up or something? I don't know. I don't know. We will see. Oh, I just noticed that my keyboard put this not out anymore. Come on. Perfect. No, it's still not perfect. What's going on? Ah. Now I know what's going on. The cable is not in the little piece anymore. Ah. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. I really don't think that the mouth is picked up that good. That's a little bit sad. Maybe I just have to talk like this. <laughs> oh god, god, god. That's really sad. I will have to calibrate um, the VTuber model completely again. And hopefully that will fix it. So, where is the Taylor? Taylor, where are you? Taylor is here and I hope he's still in there. That's not the Taylor. That's the Taylor. Is he still here? Of course not, but she is still here. Glad to see you out and about. Here you go. Take the Sundra Lily. You picked them for me. Yeah, of course. Huh? Having a hard time sleeping? Me too. Oh. Oh, that's hitting a little bit too real true, too close to real life right now. Oopsie. It's hard to uh quit quiet quiet my do you say it like that? It's hard to quiet my mind. It's always so full of ideas. Nice, nice. At least it's ideas and not sleep paralysis that's keeping you up. Okay, okay. Look at him. <laughs> it's dancing around. We have potatoes that I can potentially buy. Potatoes. Potatoes. Or did I buy potatoes already? I didn't, right? Potatoes. I'll just buy four because why not? I bought three of all of these. Well, why is it still standing, right? Oh, now I know why. Now my, my keyboard is standing, right? Good, good, good. Good, good, good. I think I will pause the recording real quick and try to calibrate my VTuber model a little bit better. And hopefully that will work out. So, see you after the cut. I am back again. I changed up some settings and it should maybe work better now. I had to zoom in the camera onto my face and yeah, it looks like it's already working a little bit better again. So I'm really glad that it actually worked out. Um, yeah, let's continue what we were doing. We have to fulfill gifts still. And I totally forgot already what Wrath wanted. Oh, potatoes. He wanted potatoes then. How about we quickly travel home and plant some potatoes? So we can still gift him potatoes in maybe that the next video when they're finally grown. So, yes, yes. And while we wait, I will be opening my energy drink. Listen. Sorry. Ooh, beautiful. <laughs> I hope it actually picked it up. We will see it later in post production. It's a pineapple monster. Yes, it is. Oh, hi, Oni. I don't have time for you at the moment. I first need to. Plant potatoes. So that's not what I wanted. Yes, yes. Hi. Say hi to the plot. Very important.
throw it. Three like this. But four like this, right? some more stuff so you'll just make all of it I'll just do it like this and then I'll slowly go up or something This one too. The dog's all the dog. Now we can plant all the stuff we got. That copper ore, nice. Perfect. Another copper ore. So let's put that away, and now we will be taking the potatoes and plant them here. And then, of course, also water them directly. Very important. That is watered. And now we can plant some other stuff as well. I do not have the chart at the moment what helps with what. So I'm just going to plant whatever, I guess. Um... Yes, let's plant some cabbage. Just have three of each. Um, the bok choy can go next to it. And I guess I'll put the mice here. And... This can go here. And I have three of this one, but just two places left. So I will just plant two of these. Yes, I think that is really good. Now we just have to water all of them. empty. Let's quickly get some more water. So, and now we're gonna go and water the rest. Perfect. Very, very nice. Let's see if those, yes, those also need some water. Oh, I can do both of them at the same time. That was kind of fun. And this one probably as well. This one as well. Perfect. Let's check if any of these need water. Oh, this one. Yes. Perfect. And we watered all the flowers as well. Put that away and... Let's check out my house again. I think I have a koi here. Do I? Do I? Panel catfish, rainbow trout, bullet bullhead. I really thought I had a koi. 
Hmm. Let's see. Do I have them in my inventory? I don't have them in my inventory. But maybe I put them in the chest? Let's see. Maybe I do have a koi in here. Do I actually sell the koi? Apparently I did sell the koi. So I do not see any koi here. Hmm. Now yes, this little cylinder is pretty adorable, so we're gonna definitely put it somewhere. Maybe we can just put it next to... Oh, that's a way bigger cylinder than I thought. Um, to like on the bed end or something. Or like next to the bed. Just have to rotate it. <laughs> Look at it. Hawaii. Very nice, very nice. Though absolutely lost this pussy. So, what a seven. Oh, it's like a leafy something. Oh, that is pretty. Oh, that is very pretty. But maybe more of like an outside thing. I think I like that a lot even. Use it like an overgrown pipe. And I actually absolutely love that. That's amazing. Yep, that's that's I like that. I really like that. So then we can put this away. This can also go away. What is that? Oh, for expanding my house. Uh, true, I bought two. Um, how do I use them again? I don't remember how I used them. Well, well, well. Anything? Probably sold it. I probably sold it. Do I have any mail? Oh gosh, I do have quite some mail. How do we go through them? So, dear Lady Lepiota, here's a little something as thanks for your continued patronage, Paul. Come spend it all in one place, mine. Okay, thanks for that. Then we have Tish. Dear Lady Lepiota, you were the first person who came to mind when I saw the sunny base. I hope it brightens your day as much as it brightens mine. Oh, that's pretty cool. We're definitely gonna put this down as soon as we read through all of that. Um, another of this? Okay, okay. Ani. Dear Lady Leopiota, so I was thinking if you were going to become a master bug hunter, like you- <laughs> Master bug? No, master bug hunter, like yours truly, you're gonna need a way to take some snacks on the go. I thought you might like this picnic blanket and basket I made it all by myself with my mom's help. That is pretty cute. I'm definitely taking that. Then we have another one from Oni. I heard you've been trying out bug catching. That's awesome. Why don't you stop by? I've got something really cool for you. It's a sneaky smoke bomb re recipe. I think we already got that one, so we don't have to do that again. Hodari. Got some new recipes in stock if you want to come check them out. It might do you good to upgrade that pick of yours, plus being able to forge a new iron bars. Uh, Forge a few iron bars to sell, never hurt anybody's wallet. Very nice seafood. Dear Lady Lepiota, apologies for my son's rudeness the other day. I wanted to let you know you are welcome in this valley, and if anybody says otherwise, they're gonna have to go through me. As a welcome gift, I made this Chapa skin rug with one of Has Hassian's spells. Just the thing for a hunter like you to rest their weary feet on. Oh, so she is the mom. Of Hassian. Hassian is the one of the the dog hell, right? Interesting. Very interesting. But nice, nice. Ashura, dear Lady Lepiota, I thought these planks would come in handy as you're settling down in your new space. Feel free to swing by the inn if you need anything. Also very nice. Another one from Tish. How are you enjoying your 
foray into furniture making. If you stop by my shop, I've got some exciting things to teach you. You will be able to make a glass furnace. Glass furnace, okay. A fabric loom and a whole new set of furniture that's perfect for any homestead. Hi, Anar. I see you have continued your pursuit in fishing. This is excellent news. I will have a new rod recipe available for you the next time you ex uh, exist within my vicinity. <laughs> Very nice. Another one from Tish. Now that you've started making all that adorable furniture, it looks like you're going to need a bigger house. Why not try this extra room for yourself? Oh! I have an extra small room. Nice. Another one from Anar. Salutations and felicitations, fellow enjoyer of the act of fishing. Would you like to learn more about this act? If so, please find me by the docks that I shall teach you. If you would not like to learn more, please do not come by the lake and I shall not teach you. Teach you. I will also not sell you this recipe for a rod health booster. Okay. Another one from Ashura. You've done it again. The word of your foraging ability is already bouncing around the tavern. Stop by and I will teach you how to make hardwood planks of that salt mill of yours. Nice, nice. You may not have seen me as I stalk my prey in the forest, but I've seen you. Wait a second, is he calling me prey? You may not have seen me as I stalk my prey in the forest, but I've seen you. Banish, uh, brandishing your makeshift bow with bands scarring every beast inside. You must share my hunting grounds. I would like to teach you to do so more effectively. Please come see me at once to approve your pitiful arrows. Nice, nice. Oh, we got a message from Wrath. Whoa. The word on the street is that you've become quite the wisp with your campfire. Stop by the inn when you have time. I have a little surprise for you. I can teach you how to make more than just food. Soon you'll be your own stove, prep station, and my secret recipe for delicious vegetable soup. I think we already did that, right? I'm not sure though. And something else from Aner. The other day my hook caught an odd fish that I realized was not a fish at all, but rather an old leather foot encasement. I put the encasement aside and when I noticed a small bit of sun-consuming life growing inside, several days later, its determination and newness to the world reminded me of you. So I gave it to Ani to deliver it to you. Deliver it to you via mail. That's really nice. Okay, we've read all of them. We have quite some stuff that we can put down in the house. But I think the first thing we will do is actually make, first of all, that away. Um, I'll just put it here for now. More room. Perfect. We have that. The picnic blanket can actually go somewhere, somewhere here, I guess. And those things are for inside. What do we need to actually make this happen? 60 and 20. 60 and 20. Okay, that's all we have. We still need um, a little bit there and two bricks. It's pretty nice, but we're gonna just drop off some stuff here. Like the beautiful, beautiful vase. Oh, it's, it's smaller than the pot, but it's okay. It's very adorable, so it's okay. I'll just I'll just put it like to the side here somewhere. And we have a rug. Draw. I think I will just put it like in front of here. And this little thing can also go somewhere. Perfect. Just perfect. Okay, okay. Very nice, very nice. I will be ending this episode here and I will continue with the next one no right after this recording. And we will finish the small room because we don't need much anymore and then we'll be able to make it. So thanks for watching. Make sure to check out all the links in this description. Make sure to also check out my Twitch because I am streaming actually three times a week now. And this video is going to come up today at 3 because I'm recording it at 10am at the moment. And it will come up on the same day at 3pm. 
and three hours later at 6 p.m. I'll be live on Twitch. So make sure to come. Make sure to get cozy and get yourself a snack and a drink as well. Because we will be um, welcoming the spooky season again, like the last stream as well. And I'm going to probably play some Dead by Daylight and maybe some Graveyard Keeper in the end to calm down. So yes, I hope you liked it and make sure to like, subscribe and comment if you like to and if you haven't yet. And it's super windy right now. I hope you... I hope it doesn't pick up on the mic. It's so windy. I have like the window open because I have an instance off. I hope... I really hope that it didn't get picked up. But well, I'm ending the episode here. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!